Welcome, Welcome back, back to, to Love, Love Island. Island. Ladies and gentlemen, we are very excited to say, why don't you tell them? Well, today's Love Island episode, the very first TMG Love Island episode, is presented by the ticket app, SeatGeek. And that's actually, it's kind of cool. I mean, we yeah. haven't had a SeatGeek ad in a long, long, long time, so this time. is great. Yeah. Live events are back, and if you're looking for tickets to anything, sports, concerts, whatever, uh, whatever, <laughs> Make sure to download SeatGeek and use promo code TMG for 20, 20 bones off your first purchase. That's 20, 20, 20 bucks. 20 bucks. 20 Moonies. British quid. That's not, 20, not actually, quid. 20, 20 US dollars. Yeah. <laughs> shouldn't yeah, shouldn't promise that. Yeah, like, yeah, what the yeah. fuck? <laughs> uh, so thank you, SeatGeek. And enjoy this episode. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back to Love Island. Yeah. All right, we're here to answer a couple questions out, out the gate. Yes, we're going to play the game. Okay, we're going to play the game. Yeah. You don't have to worry. We're gonna play the game. This is this is kind of interesting because now we're in the meta of a podcast, a, a video podcast. What do you mean? Where now we have to kind of talk to the camera and podcast at the same time. Yeah. So this is you know we're breaking boundaries. Here. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm really glad we took steroids for this though. Well, that's the thing is that people have. Um, have been wondering where you've been. Like, why? Why'd you stop Love Island? Why'd you stop? It's such a great series. Because we were, right we were here, in the bro. fucking gym, dude. <laughs> I had to what get do you think? Fucking boot you think this body season. happens overnight? No. You think this body happens overnight? No. <laughs> Look at that. Muscles so real, you could spank them. Ah, oh, <laughs> man, this it feels so fucking good to be Jack. Yeah. <laughs> this is the this is the body I've wanted since forever, and to finally have it is just. It feels good, right? Isn't it like? Every morning I wake up and I look at this, I cry a little bit. I because of, like, have happiness? Yeah, it's just tears of accomplishment and joy. I just can't believe how I fucking cry. yoked I, I am. I cry because the trend is fucking with my yeah. like, emotions. It's making you really angry and I'm horny and Crazy sad. mood swings. It's yeah. weird. Like, I'll go from <laughs> being super pumped. <laughs> I want to fuck! <laughs> It's, it, it's, the craziest part about these is the abs, dude. Like, oh, having look at how abs sick my dope. abs are. Yeah. Oh, like listening. You just, oh, with, you like, could ski on these moguls. You definitely could. I mean, more than that, I think. Oh, oh, sorry. Body roll. <laughs> oh, body roll. <laughs> <laughs> I know some of you are watching this, and you want to rip some of these abs out and make a little hamburger out of out of some meat. Yeah. What? Oh, sorry. Do I have? Bigger titties than you? Oh. 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 Sorry. It's always rough when your tits are bigger than his, yeah? Ah, uh, yeah, mate. Uh, <laughs> 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 no, this, this, I know, when some people watch this, they're going to get taken to a different place, which is, I'm pretty sure this is how it feels to look at <laughs> those 7-Eleven hot dogs at like 3 a.m. Right. And they're like pretty fucking high, and then there's the last <laughs> two just spinning in the cage. You're like, damn. <laughs> They're just flexing at you. Oh, man, the amount of times that I've been there. Yeah, yeah. In that same, like, oh, God, I know this is going to be food poisoning, but. <laughs> just putting two fingers on the glass. I want you. I want it. Just glistening. I want you. Glistening in that, in that like, lizard light. Yeah. God. I need you. Glizzy. Come and get me, then. <laughs> you want it? You should gain like, right here, bro. <laughs> are you saying that's what we are? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. We're the we're the last two hot dogs in the 7-Eleven. Oh, tricep. Oops. <laughs> Oops. You just can't help it. Sorry. I just, just revealed a little. Oops. This little pop out? Yeah. A little slip? A little. Oh, oh, sorry about that. A little trip slip? What's that right there? <laughs> oh, is that. That's between a rock and a hard place right there. <laughs> <laughs> that's what that is. You ever watch Free Solo? Uh, the rock climbing shit? Yeah. Uh, Where he, he climbs. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yosemite, like. Yeah, with, with no. Dude. I just watched that. Yeah. Fuck, man. Yeah. Anyways, <laughs> that's for that's, the other. That's, that's for the, the other, other show. show. Yeah, <laughs> that's for the other. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, let's get to business then. Yeah. Speaking of being absolutely sl fucking slammed. Slammed. Yo. What's I, a wait wait? What's a British word for being joked? For being joked? For being joked? For, that's jokes. For um, being yoked. What is absolutely it? slotted. Yeah, they always have some crazy ass. So absolutely slotted. Absolutely just jammed. Um, what's a no? They always have like weird because fit is phrases a, for things. Fit is like that's that's like attractive. A yeah, that's like 
Yeah. He's fit. Yeah. So yeah. what is it? Can somebody look that up? Yeah. Yeah, yes. slang for being yoked. For being yoked. As a Briton. For having bodies like us. If you look oh. like us in the UK, what would people say? Oh, that man is absolutely slotted, bruv. Look like us. Can I say it's actually it's really nice to be here at the villa. Shit is. Show. It's crazy that they, that they finally brought us here. Finally, ITV yeah. fucking acknowledges us, flies us out to Mallorca to shoot it oh, in yeah. the villa. And it just feels great. Yeah. It's Not many people unreal. get this privilege. Yeah. But, but we did. I mean, the problem was they had to like, carry us in through a crane because we, we went to the door and it's like, it's not wide it's enough. Not, we're not it, fitting. It's just too big, bro. It's just, oh, sorry, it's my rear doubts. <laughs> it's my front doubts. It's too big for the doorway. <laughs> All right, it's love. Michael Caine. <laughs> 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 so this is Love Island season seven? Season seven, baby. It's I, finally back on. I, uh, I queued up season six and I started playing it and I... I said, wait a second. Wait a minute. Did they call back the cast? Oh, I've seen this. I've seen this, mate. What uh, the bullocks is this? <laughs> <laughs> um, what'd you think? So we, uh, you know what? First of all, let me just say this. It was pretty hard getting the episode just on my TV. Well, you think for the amount of fucking US viewers that yeah. watch this damn show, it'd yeah. be, there'd be an easier way to watch it along with <clears throat> the people in the UK. Yeah. Well, it's because I think they want people to watch Love Island U.S., but yes. <laughs> if you're if you're like an original consume, <clears throat> consumer of Love Island, you want the original, and you know it's just not the same. Like the U.S. version is dees, it's dees, but it's just not the same. <laughs> Are we allowed to say that? What? Are we allowed to say that? We're allowed to say fucking anything. Yeah. So yeah, what this do is I our care? own show. Yeah. What do, why do I care? I feel like ITV did fly us here. This but is true. We yeah. own the show still. We can say whatever the fuck we want. This is true. Yeah, no. Lo Lo Love Island US is it's, it's 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 just cool. It's just all right. Yeah. But UK is. Mwah. Are we gonna watch the US version? That's that's something I was wondering because it starts in two weeks. So if we watch both of them, but we could do this about both of them. No. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> no. That's we'll Australian. Watch the Australian version though. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> No, it's just it's just a lot to keep up with. Yeah. Um. So out out the gate, we're already talking. We noticed a couple things. Hold on. I'm gonna hit my tan a little bit. Oh, just gonna. I'm gonna get the bronze. Probably I good. Got burnt. I don't know if anyone can tell, but I'm peeling a little bit. I think you need to work on your legs. Because I got really burnt. I do need to work on my legs. Yeah. Yeah, they're pale. I don't know why you tan in pants. I know. <laughs> You're always tanning in pants. It's crazy. Because I'm really self conscious. Well, oh, we're we're legs. already talking about it like. Uh, out the gate, you can't help but notice the water bottles are different. Yeah. Why, why? Um, Maybe they got like a water bottle sponsor or some shit. Well, first, let's say this. So you, well, you, they, for all the people in America that want to watch this show, mm. let's tell them the steps that we took to watch it because yeah. that's important. People need to be able to watch this along with us. Yeah. So you got to fucking use a VPN. Yeah. You've got to use a VPN, mate. Yeah, and which actually brings us to our first sponsor. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, use whatever VPN you want. Or y you can use the ITV website, but the fucking resolution is super low, isn't it? Or was that just the VPN? It's just the VPN you're using. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, okay. so the, some VPNs are a little bit faster. Gotcha. So I, I did some, you know, sussing around. Okay. And I figured out one that was gotcha. mint. And then you got to watch that Just Eat commercial like 50 yep. fucking times. Yep. Dude, with them. Yep. That was last season too. Yep. The amount of times I saw that same commercial. And, and You think like online shows, like they would have figured out advertising by now. Like cable advertising is way better. Online you get the same five fucking mid-roll ads every single time. It's like how is that effective? You're just losing money. <laughs> I mean, I, I always felt like the ad system was just broken. Like right. it, it was just like some mistake. I'm like, this this can't be right. Yeah. Because telling me to eat Uber Eats 20 times in a row, <laughs> one time it might have worked. But after 20, my brain is finally going, nah, fuck you. <laughs> it's just, you know, it's too, it's too little or too little, too much. Yeah. Um, I'm just trying to like. So I ended up streaming it. Yeah. Illegally. <laughs> Because it's the only way I can get it with nice resolution on my TV. I want to see the glistening bodies. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah. I don't want to see pixels. Yeah, agree. Pixels. I don't want to say pixels. <laughs> you want to see the real thing? Yeah, I want a high uh, resolution. So I streamed it and um, we got it up. And uh, I mean, overall, first episode. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, it would. You know what I found about this episode? Mm. <clears throat> the people seem to really like not dig each other. Yeah. Did you get that vibe over yeah. the last one? Yeah. So I feel, I felt, felt, I felt. See, this is the problem. Once you start <laughs> watching the show, you just like your your accent and the, how, you, how you say things it starts to get messed up. I felt like. <laughs> what are you gonna go Scottish, Irish? I don't even know. We got everyone. Yeah. Oh, everything. Season. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake! The first off, everyone, uh, every everyone was just like normal, attractive. Yeah, no, no one was there. They they didn't do the thing where they bring the thirty out of ten. Yeah, you know, usually they, that's the last person that they bring right, in. Right, right. But I felt sorry. Go ahead. I felt everyone was just it was just like regular tens. Mm -hmm. You know, which. We're gonna. I know I'm gonna get shit for saying that. Why? I don't know. People say like, oh no, well, you clearly live in L.A. because if you thought they were just ten, I don't know, whatever. No, no, no. But here's here's what I think. I think they still like to keep Love Island somewhat relatable. Yeah. If that makes any sense. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Like, cause there are like they could just pick people off Instagram that have millions of followers. There are already totally like true. people already. There's already like number proof that people think that they're hot. You right. know what I'm saying? But they don't. They try to find new people that yeah. have like. The one guy that came on, the, the my favorite guy. I, I don't know his name. Uh, the the tall one with the crazy ass accent. Um, he's got he's like uh, yeah, I don't know if he's tall. Was he the last dude to show up and he paired with Faye in the blue bikini? Um, no, he paired with he was the second guy to pair with Faye, and then he got kicked. Oh, um, what the fuck Toby? is his name? Toby maybe. Yeah, the, he's really talkative. The bootleg super West. funny. Yes. Yeah. I wouldn't say that guy's like super attractive <laughs> conventionally. You know Damn. what I'm saying? Um, but he's he's fucking hilarious. Yeah. Hilarious. Yeah. yeah. And immediately it's like clearly this guy is like it's mostly not mostly personality, but you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like it's that's just going to be his winning thing. He's hilarious. He made everyone laugh like right away. Oh, sure. And I was like, oh, I yeah, mean, he's this is great. No, no, no. I, I 100 percent know what you mean. Like he. Well, so he was the only one to me that had personality. The dude Jake kind of uh, Kaz had it. She was like super bubbly, like chatty. Um, but the rest of them just felt kind of reserved about. <laughs> Sorry, no, you're all good. No, no, no. I just I you have to keep posing or else. Oh. Like it's, impra it's important to practice posing as yeah. we're chatting. Yeah. Because I felt like everyone else just they didn't. Yeah, it's that, I think that that contributed to the vibe of like no one was into each other. They were all just sort of super reserved, and no one was like a spark. Yeah, the, everyone right away was like uh, super kind of apprehensive about getting to know their person that they picked. Like mm -hmm. everyone thought they were in the wrong couple, sort of, and they're yeah. all like, "Ah, yeah, there's just no spark here." It's like you don't you, you fucking known each other for twenty fucking minutes. My thought there though is maybe they did that on purpose. Because there is something funny about the end of the episode where they all, uh, they don't really like each other, but now they're going to get eliminated. Yeah. So that might make the next episode really funny. Yeah. Because now the, you'll, like, without fail, I feel that that is always true to Love Island, yeah. where there's a bit of an awkwardness and then the game hits. And yeah. Like, all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's true. Let the it, bullshit restart. Yeah. Let yeah. the chat. <laughs> the chat you guys better start grafting. <laughs> Um, hey guys, we want to take a quick break to thank the sponsor of today's episode, BetterHelp. Life is full of stressors. It doesn't matter who you are or what you have. Your life is probably stressful. We all feel stress. Yeah, truly. every day, man. Job, money, relationships, everything in life yes, causes you know, stress. Even the pressure to keep up this beautiful image. I know. Uh, no, seriously, you may uh, not be feeling necessarily down or out or even depressed um, or you know, like a total loss or something. But if your stress is high, maybe you're a little bit more irritable or you're just starting to feel strained in relationships, uh, which I think escapes most people, um, you could probably use a chance to uh, let that go. Um, just unload the stress and get it out. Uh, and talk to someone who's completely unbiased by your life, you know, someone who isn't going to judge you or take sides on a situation. When there are things you can't tell anyone or feel like 
uh, you can't unload to family or friends, you need to get it off your chest and that's what therapy can be. BetterHelp is customized online therapy that offers video, phone, and even live chat sessions with your therapist so you don't have to see anyone on camera if you don't want to. Yeah, uh, it's definitely more affordable than in-person therapy and you can start communicating with a therapist in under 48 hours. Uh, so let go of those stressors and get some unbiased feedback. Uh, you might be surprised at what you gain from it and see if it's for you. Uh, this episode is sponsored by BetterHelp uh, and all our listeners will get 10% off the first month of be at betterhelp.com slash TMG. Uh, so that's B-E-T-T-E-R-H-E-L-P dot com slash TMG. Get 10% off your first month. <laughs> that was that was what it's, she said that to fucking what's the guy's Callum or no Caleb or something like that the teacher oh uh, Gumby Gump, damn bro <laughs> damn Hugo <laughs> his name's Hugo yeah oh we just torsion appearances now I mean he just he kind of just Look, reminded me dude, of like Love Island it's like you can't not comment on their appearance like yeah fair like it's what it's what you see <laughs> it's what the game is so. I mean, they do it before we even no, no, have to I know, do it, right? I know. The very first thing, by, by the way, can we just comment on how spectacular the first episode of Love Island is, the structure of it? Like, oh, yeah. Whoever fucking invented that or wrote that, Nobel Prize. <laughs> when the girls stand up there Nobel and the guys Prize. stand up and the girls have to, <laughs> the Nobel Peace Prize. You know, just up there with yes. you know, you have people oh, yeah. curing cancer yep. and mm -hmm. discovering black holes and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> When the girl has Steven, to would you mind rolling aside? <laughs> we have the creator of Love Island here. <laughs> but wait, but I invented S insulin. Steven, could you Shh, dude. Steven, could you just move your chair? <laughs> we need to let the creator of Love Island onto the stage. Hello. <laughs> Black holes are the <laughs> end in the beginning. Steven, if you could just but shut shut the fuck up. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, so when, when the women stand up. Yes, yeah, so I think it actually gives us free range to comment on people's appearance. No, that's fair, yeah. The fact that they start their own show like that where yeah. they ask the girls, hey, if anyone's attracted to this guy, step forward, and no one does. Yeah. It's the meanest, like, most heartbreaking thing ever. Yeah. <clears throat> and so, uh, what's his name? Hugo. Hugo. <laughs> Gumby? Gumby. <laughs> he looks like Gumby, I'm sorry. I mean, he has the same eyes. Yes, exactly. Compl and to the me, same like facial shape. To me, he was more like a like a a curious bird or something. Yeah. All the random close-ups of him killed me. <laughs> They'd just be like in the middle of something, and then his face would be like. <laughs> I'm a teacher, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> Should I put a lesson plan up on the board? He was like, "I'm not going to talk about being a teacher too much," and then it's every single one of his yeah. jokes. <laughs> yeah. It's Should I good. put it up on the whiteboard? And it's like, Dude, no. <laughs> so. He steps up and none of the girls step. Forward. She goes, nah. if you, if anyone here thinks uh, Callum is, <laughs> what's his name? G Hugo. 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 I'm He's attractive. Hugo, Gumby Hugo. <laughs> Gumby. If anyone here thinks Gumby's attractive, step forward. And nobody does. And he goes, ah. And she goes, you better start grafting. You, <laughs> <laughs> you better get some personality. Because yeah. you're fucking ugly. <laughs> I wouldn't. I wouldn't have put put it past anyone to say that. That's the rough part about English people. Why would you not step forward? He's quite ugly. Yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah. No fair play to her. No, it's all right. <laughs> Sorry, love. I just you're quite ugly. <laughs> no. Yeah. Yeah. Fair play to her. I mean, it's just like early days. Yeah. And for them not to get offended by that too. Yeah. It's the most British shit ever. Yeah. It's like yeah. yeah Trust me. Just I've, not, I've heard that my, my whole life. It's all right. It's all right. Yeah. That's the thing. No one came at it like, I'm gonna, you know, I'm get, I'm ready to get in there, start grafting, and da da da. Everyone's just sort of like, yeah, I, I'm really excited to be on the show. Mm -hmm. oh, what are these wet blankets? Yeah. Even the dude Toby, <clears throat> you know, uh, knock off Wes. He like, I felt like even he was in there like, who in here, like wants to talk, like wants to do anything. Yeah, I know. So, I yeah. I think it, the game part is going to have to motivate a lot of the behavior. But th the, this episode started out horny right away. Yeah. Which makes me wonder what it's going to be like the rest of the time. Yeah. Because uh, that shit was hilarious when <laughs> they just kept editing that dude, Jake, in his interview saying, like, suck toes. <laughs> or suck little white toes. Or suck toes. <laughs> Was that the, was it the Irish guy or the Scottish guy? I, I don't know what he was, but the guy with, ta with tattoos, yeah, shorter like, guy, yeah, he, you know, he's kind of smaller than <laughs> us, a little bit smaller than us, yeah, yeah, a tiny bit, just a little bit. He yeah. looked like he was out of the game. 
Yeah. I was busting up laughing when he came running down the stairs and he stood there and it was just like, Gary! <laughs> like, it was that same... <laughs> just, yeah, he sprinted. He full yeah. sprinted <laughs> down the stairs. <laughs> Oh, what's up, girls? <laughs> All right, looking good, girls. <laughs> looking good, girls. 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 Yeah. G-O-W-S. They killed him. Girls. He said, I like sucking toes one time, and the editor went, <laughs> it's over for you, pal. I'm going to oh, bury you, you with this. You like sucking toes way more than that. Yeah. I'm going to make sure of it. <laughs> <laughs> just just tons of b-roll and if i could i it's like all edited together and fake if i could i would kill my mom and suck toes instead <laughs> i would feed a nine-year-old nails <laughs> to I suck some toes for the rest of my life <laughs> it's all like yeah, yeah, yeah like a <laughs> different take ransom letter yeah <laughs> <laughs> little white toes oh, i just want to su suckle on them <laughs> I want to. I, I also want to suck dick. <laughs> hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, come on. And then when Kaz was in her interview and she's like, I just want a man who can rail me. Dude, that was. I had that written down because that was one of my favorite parts. Yeah. I was like, damn. Out the gate, she just no holds barred. She's like, I'm just trying to get railed. <laughs> Every I just want a man to pile drive me. <laughs> Every Every dude watching this show was like, whoa. <laughs> Whew. I'm very submissive. I just want to get railed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Single guys fleeing to the application <laughs> site. Will you accept any more? Will you accept any more? Kaz. I like that part because, you know, cut, she cut the bullshit. Normally yeah. it's like. I want someone, you know, I can vibe with. And you're like, I don't know what that means. Or like, <laughs> you know, I, I want someone who can really make me laugh, who's who's goal oriented. And she's like, I just want to get piped. <laughs> I'm just trying to get fucking smashed. That's it. Yeah. And I was like, it, I mean, I wish the guys would do that too. You know, it's like, I just want to suck some boob. Yeah. Well, I mean, Jake wanna, was the closest one. What? Oh, yeah, yeah. I guess, yeah. I like sucking toes. Sucking toes. Is, uh... <laughs> Man, I just it was it was hilarious too. I want to suck some dick. <laughs> some girl. I'm just trying to suck some dick off. <laughs> I mean, that's basically what Kaz did. I was chuckling because her interview is like, I'm 25, I'm a fashion blogger, and I like sex. <laughs> I just really like sex. I want a man that can rail me. <laughs> it's it's like it was just like cut after cut. I'm very submissive. I want a man that's gonna hold me down. <laughs> Is that okay to say? <laughs> Throw me against the wall. Every, yeah, everyone after that was uninteresting. Do me doggy style. <laughs> Ch what? Ch Fold my legs up. <laughs> let's do it. Let's do it all. Ass to mouth. Let's do it. <laughs> Wait, pull it out and stick it back in. Stick it back do in. Do whatever you want. <laughs> I want to slobber on something. I want to spit on it. <laughs> I want something that I need two hands. Perhaps I need help with it. <laughs> Cameraman sweating. I want. I, I want to. Yeah, just, the whole thing's bleep. You can't even see what she's saying. Yeah, the cameraman just looking through the <sighs> eyepiece, <is> like <laughs> pouring sweat. <sighs> Pour like just <laughs> pouring sweat up. <laughs> and it's just like like all reverbed in his head. I want a man that can pipe me, hold me down. I love a man me. who can work a camera as well. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't mind if he filmed it. <laughs> put his balls and cock in my throat. <laughs> his balls in my throat? <laughs> I'd suck some dick right now. <laughs> I'm actually feeling quite horny right now. <laughs> I like the smell in this room, to be honest. Oh, this chat just makes me want to slobber on something <laughs> immediately. I'm going to have to end this and just go suck some... I want to suck some dick. <laughs> just, the guy just and the camera sleeps. I love you. <laughs> what? What's that? What's that then? What's that then? Uh, did, did somebody new, say uh, did, something? Uh, the battery, battery, need a battery, battery. Did new somebody, card, did somebody new card? say something? I love the sound of that man's <laughs> voice. It makes me want to suck his dick. <laughs> Dude's wettering just like on fire <laughs> on his hands. <laughs> He's like, uh. 
<laughs> yeah, just do what, do whatever you want with me, honestly. <laughs> whatever you want. That's why I think Kaz, Toby, <clears throat> Jake are probably going to be the most interesting people to start. Yeah, I don't know any of their names, so. Uh, Jake is Suck Toes guy. Okay. Kaz yep. is. He's already pretty funny. Kaz is I want to get nailed. Yeah, okay. And I feel like she's going to be interesting because I feel like she embraces it. Like, she's there, and she's like, who do you like? It's like she she went up to the, to the uh, her name's Liberty, the blonde girl that um, Suck Toes guy yeah. paired with. Uh-huh. Immediately, she's like, do you like him? You should go sit with him. You should, like, she's kind of like trying to stir the pot a little bit. Okay. So I, I think that's good. And then um, who uh, who's the third one? Toby, like soccer player dude. Yeah. I know he's just – Leading, if he makes it to Castle more, he's not gonna last. Yeah, he will. <laughs> I think he'll try to funk everybody in that house. Oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> and I mean, it, we're we're just getting started. Like normally on the first episode, you actually get to meet like the alternate, like the person that comes in at the end. Yeah. But they didn't do that this time. Which was like good, good for next episode. Yeah. But like that's usually what fucks everything up. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. so there's gonna be way more drama. I think um, so. <clears throat> another thing is that wait, is Kaz the the one that's kind of smart? the girl they always have like two people that aren't dumb like the like in this case yeah. it's the teacher and the girl who's like a civil servant that's chloe chloe okay yeah like they always have two people like that that won't find love because they're like boring. too smart for the show and in they're that, boring yeah yeah and that's like the <clears throat> teacher guy and this girl like you yeah. tell right away like they had zero connection with each other because they're like <laughs> they never do yeah on the show those, pe- those two people never get together no nah. And then they're too smart for the dumb people. So yeah. they're kind of just end up being like, oh, the show kind of sucks. I, I just know that I, you know what I feel like it is? I feel like the teacher dude is a, a cattle being sent out <laughs> for slaughter. Yeah. Yes. There's going to be some girl that comes in there and he's going to like, I've never yeah. met someone like this. And he's going to make a bunch of teacher jokes. Yeah. And, he, and, and she's going to be like, oh. No, she'll she'll kind of lap it up, and he doesn't know. Yeah, that she's just like, you know, she just yeah. Come here, Lenny. Yeah. All right, now look out to the lake. Yeah. And then that's when the hot guy comes in, and she's like, <laughs> and then, <laughs> you know. <laughs> yeah, it's I just mean, it's I, unfortunate, I, but it happens every single season. I just mean that because as a teacher, he do, he, or not even as a teacher, he just doesn't seem like the kind of guy that's like out meeting women and like you know it doesn't seem like a like a like a skeezer he's not a lad no he's, he's not a geezer he's no. he's gotten i don't think he's got any chat no. i think he's a nice guy but yeah. that's the problem <laughs> that never works on this show when he you was can't just be a nice guy when he was taking up their drinks to like pour them out i was like ah oh, this is over for you what did he do i didn't he's like he's like oh let, let me grab your drinks so i'll bring you uh, new ones it's just like ah oh, yeah no you gotta go get one for yourself mm-hmm doormat yeah and <laughs> <laughs> just killing this guy man i feel bad you know what i feel bad because the people that we make fun of always at the beginning of the show they always end up like being totally different from how we our first impressions totally, are yeah like for example faye fucking insane like i can tell already that girl's crazy uh, yeah uh, yeah faye the way she's like her <laughs> she dude, got that, them all. the eyes I mean, she, she, from her like giant fake eyebrows, she has to like hold her eyes open to, I mean, they're so heavy. I, when someone says, um, I'm crazy and I need, and I need someone to balance me out. Yeah. She just, that's just full up. Like, yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm a goddamn Roman candle over yes. here. Yeah. You know, like, so yeah, <laughs> just the staring, the, the staring when the, when whoever guy, the guy that she's with, what's his name is Brad, Brad. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> and he, the yeah. guy is like talking in circles with mm-hmm. her. What, what did he say again? He's like, yeah, I, it's, it's so cool that we can all get to know like other people. Yeah, and he's but like, I like you. Yeah. I'd love to get to know you, but I l- really like to get to know other people yeah, as well. And, and just... the whole time she's like, mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. She just like, looks, this girl is. She looks animatronic. Oh, exactly. <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> Freak me out. Hello. Hello. Hello, Fresh. <laughs> Another sponsor of today's episode. <laughs> oh, <laughs> man. What is HelloFresh? Well, hello, Fresh. You get, uh, with HelloFresh, you get fresh, pre measured ingredients and mouth watering seasonal recipes delivered right to your door. 
Skip trips to the grocery store and count on Hello Fresh to make home cooking easy, fun, and affordable. And that's why it's America's number one meal kit. Hello Fresh cuts out stressful meal planning and grocery store trips so you can enjoy cooking and get dinner on the table in just about 30 minutes or less. Hello Fresh offers 50 menu and market items each week, including ready to eat salads, sandwiches, and soups. There's something for everyone to enjoy with all recipes designed and tested by professional chefs and nutritional experts to ensure deliciousness and simplicity. I love HelloFresh. You know I love to make them beep and bop. <laughs> beep and bop. <laughs> what are you, Conor McGregor? <laughs> beep and bop. That's not Conor McGregor. No. Oh, she's always beep and bop. Oh, stop it. Oh, I love oh, no, to no, make no, the beep no, and bop. No, no. If you're interested, go to hellofresh.com slash tinymeat14 and use code tinymeat14 for up to 14 free meals plus free shipping. That's hellofresh.com slash tinymeat14 and use code tinymeat14 for up to 14 free what meals what is it? plus free shipping. Tinymeat14. Oh. HelloFresh, America's number one meal kit. Um, I would love it if the civil servant girl, like if she just, if she just embraced the game because she works in politics... And yeah. if she just turned into a savage, or she was like, "Oh, I do this every day," yeah, and just marched her way to the end somehow, yeah, I would love. I, <clears throat> no one's ever done that in Love on Or I feel like Adam. This has actually been a couple people, maybe, but I want someone to go on that show and full up like when they get into the confessional and they close the door, they're like, "I don't like any of these people." Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I guess you can't really win. Yeah, you have to like charm the na the nation. That's one of the points. <sighs> is that that people have to love you as a couple? <clears throat> Do you actually have to like find love? Hmm. You know what? This also makes me realize how much fucking too hot to handle stole from Love Island. Oh yeah. Everything. Yeah. Every single mechanic they use they yeah. use in that show they stole. Yeah. Fucked up. And it's not. You know. It, it, I I I don't even support it, dude. <laughs> You don't. You won't even watch it. I don't even watch that shit, bro. <laughs> How dare you bring up that name? <laughs> I am pissed that you just brought that up, dude. Honestly, too hot to handle is just like, basically now it's like, or I mean, like now it's it's always been since the first season. It's just a road to being TikTok famous. <sighs> it's like a micro bachelor. It is. That's what Ugh. it is. Ugh. Netflix is just like, how can we make our own batch of TikTok stars? Oh, this is how. Ugh. Like, I, I saw the one dude that guy had the cockroach land on his face. Mm -hmm. That famous clip that's going all over TikTok. Yeah. I went on his TikTok page last night, or it came up on my For You page, and it's just all him making jokes about the cockroach moment. And they all have over a, mil over a million views. It's like, Boo. it's just a recipe. Yeah. You know? Well, you know, that's what's cool about Love Island. You could be anything when you come out of Love Island. Exactly. You could be I a mean, music look star. At fucking, you could be a boxer. You could be a boxer. Look at Tommy. I mean, look at Molly. They're fucking killing it. Are they're they killing it? I have not looked at either of their socials in oh, a long dude, time. Oh, dude, they're killing it, man. If someone from London, tell, please tell me if they're actually like big celebrities there because it seems like Molly is like kind of a fashion person icon now. Right, I guess Tommy maybe. Fury. I mean, maybe I'm wrong. Um, but also, Tommy's like winning boxing matches. Yeah, I mean, you could put a little asterisk next to his opponents, but oh, uh, really? Yeah. What? If you look at their records, ah, uh, so th this padding. <laughs> Padding is yeah, I think Tom bit. Tommy's still in the beginning of his career, so that aspect. But I mean, the dude is fucking huge. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he's massive. Hey, can you bring up Tommy's Tommy Fury's Instagram right now? Um, on the screen, real fast. This dude is gigantor. Just because his arms actually look like our arms right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm really glad that he put the time in to finally. And he, he used to DM us. He's like, I, I, I want to look like you. We gave him our workout plan, and we're finally here. All right, let me look up Molly May. Yeah, how many followers? Like, just look how many how, how many likes does she get on her? You know, for pictures. all the bagging people did on her, like interest in Tommy being fake and all that, they're still together. Yeah, they are, and they're they're uh, they seem to be they seem to be in love. You know, holy shit! I mean, as everyone says in Instagram, her what, what you see on Instagram normally is uh, uh, accurate representation of real life 100%. and what's going on in real life. A thousand percent. So just. Damn, she's, <clears throat> she, she blew up on, on the gram. 5.6 million followers. That's what I'm saying. This is crazy. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. It's not, Love know. Island is, uh, a, you know, a jumping off platform for anything. You a can lot be of anyone. People. Yeah. Carrington, uh, you know, he stopped by my place and we <clears throat> chatted for a little bit. He just got an agent. He's working on stuff. Yeah. You know, it's like he was on season one of Love Island US, like, which arguably wasn't that popular. Right. You know, it was like still new. Yeah. To. The states. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, and actually, 
why don't we talk about this too? Hold on. Yeah, go, wait, go scroll down. Scroll down, scroll down. Okay, look at, hold on, just scroll back up. Maybe that bottom middle picture. Yeah, that bottom Tyson middle Fury. picture is the hilarious one. You just gotta open it in a new tab. <clears throat> His, I mean, he's gotta be on the juice a little bit. <laughs> Look at his fucking arms. I mean, look at his brother, though. <laughs> I mean, they, you want to talk about, like, Gumby build? These guys have, like, a cartoon build. They are... They, they're they just absurd in yeah. uh, stature and yeah. physique. Yeah. Like, look how small their heads are compared to their bodies. <laughs> like, these guys are, like, like Koopa Troopas. <laughs> like... <laughs> He's on the juice a little bit. This is what happens when you take a Koopa Troopa's shell off. This is like what's underneath. Mm. Like a small ass head mm -hmm. and it's huge. Yeah. I mean, they have to be on the juice because we took trying to get like this. We had to. Yeah. There's no, no way. The trend cough is brutal. That's why I've been coughing the last couple episodes. Just because the trend. It's <laughs> taking trend. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yep. And uh, Buddy's yoked. Anyways, I fucking suck. <laughs> That's part of trend too. Yeah. Those are the mood swings. God, I fuck. <laughs> Not that anyone would care. That's why we've been doing that actually. That's because of the trend. <laughs> That's not funny. Yeah, our, our emotions are <sighs> cratering under the trend. Stupid callback. Fucking so. I'm so horny. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, so we can talk about this. So, Carrington got an agent. He's do he's making moves. Mm -hmm. Um. And you said it was. Did we talk about that on the other on, on, on the, the space? Not, not not really. But I, I didn't bring that up. Was no. it fun hanging with him? Yeah, no, it was great. I mean, we talked about how how ripped he is. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's about it. Nice. And we took some pictures uh, at my place, and you know, I thought I was making a lot of progress physically. Mm -hmm. I got on the scale the other yesterday. I'm one sixty two and a half. Okay. Holy fuck. What? Yeah. 162? <laughs> yeah. Jesus Christ. I couldn't believe And that was like after a <clears> shit, <throat> all I had had was um, a, like a liquid death of water. Wait, are you sure? 162, that's it? Well, this was this was before. Oh, okay, okay. You know. Okay. This is before I rehydrated. Gotcha. <laughs> okay, okay. I had to weigh before, in. Yeah, yeah. I ate a protein bar this morning. That's why, yeah. that's why I look so good right now. When I, I had a little bit of a pump. When I rehydrate and have a little creatine, mm -hmm. and then I'm back up to 210. Okay. Yeah. Got it. But without that, you know. 162 and a half. Yeah. That's raw muscle. You have to understand, it's 162 pounds of pure muscle. Okay, yeah, no organs or anything. Mm -hmm. It's just muscle. Mm -hmm. okay. And so when I um, when I hung out with him, I'm like, how much does this fucker weigh? And I looked at this picture of us. I'm like, dude, I, I've, I've put on size, but it looks like not at all right. compared to that dude. Yeah. Kids got pipes. I mean, that's just years and years of... In the gym of every pumping. single day, yeah. you know what I'm saying? There, they click that picture. Th right this there, was yeah. yeah, this was before I started trend. <clears throat> okay, so this, this is before your cycle. This is before my cycle. Yeah, trend actually is a really short cycle. Mm -hmm. it's like so you only need to take it for minutes. a couple days, or a couple minutes, and then <laughs> you just get huge. And then you can sometimes just feel it start. Yeah, and your shirt sometimes just ends up ripping, pushing out yep. of your whole body. Yep. Bro, um, wait, hold on. We didn't even. Uh, sorry, what were you gonna say? Because I do want to cover, like, I want to talk about one other thing in that in the episode. Okay. Well, I was going to talk, just while, while we're on the subject of past Love Island people doing crazy things. Mm. I've been listening to Wes Nelson's music nonstop. Oh, he's amazing. Nonstop. Yeah. Like, the dude's music is unbelievable. Check that guy out. Wes, Wes Nelson what, on what, Spotify. What was crazy was when we were in, um, we're at the Reading Festival. Yeah. And we saw him. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Did we, even, did we ever tell, tell the story on the podcast? Uh, we, I think we did. Okay. Yeah. We like ran into him at a Selfridges. Yeah. Him yeah. and him and Meg. Yeah. Two and people, two of our, like, I mean, two, like the, f they went really far in season three, was it? Or season yeah. four? Mm -hmm. And it was like, it was four. you know, we had just, it was four. It we was just four. finished watching the show and we were going to London <laughs> with post. And then, it was and like, we were like, I wonder, Kelsey and I were like, I wonder if there's any chance we're going to see the Love Island people. But it's like, London's a fucking huge place, you know? Mm -hmm. We ended up running into them in the Sulfurges. Yep. And they recognized Post, obviously. Yeah. But then we were with him, so we started chatting with him. We, like, made friends with him, basically. Yeah. And then we hung out with him backstage at the Reading Festival. Yeah. And so when we were back there, um, <clears throat> someone started playing uh, Someone started playing beats. 
and people started like freestyling and Wes kind of like he perked up and then he I, he like uh he I think he like le- I forgot what he's like how it started but he basically kind of leaned over to me and was like he's like oh if they really want to do that right now like I'm I'm, pff, I'm gonna get in there and I was like oh you I'm like oh do you like do you spit fire yeah I was, I was like you rap like and then he and he was like he was like oh yeah he's like no trust me like he had like this like he's like i'm gonna do music that's what he told me and so when he got the label deal i was like damn he's really going after it and then from his first song i'm like Pff. yeah Pff. i mean it's not really grime it's like more singing no this is saying 100 percent. this isn't grime at all but it's it's really fucking good yeah like his his melodies are so simple but really catchy yeah no he's he's he kills it. Yeah, I've been listening to him nonstop. He can sing his ass off too. That's what I'm saying, man. World's your oyster after Love <laughs> Island. You know, that's what makes this show so beautiful. <laughs> and you know what? Another thing I was just thinking about, because <laughs> like as we're talking about all the people from the fucking show that we've met and interacted with, I always think like we got to be careful how much shit we talk. <laughs> yeah, because it'll bite us in the ass once we because like, we yeah, always end up meeting these people somehow. Yeah. You know. So after all that shit we talked about, that teacher. He's for sure gonna be just walking down the street. Absolutely. And he'll be wearing a TMG hoodie and he'll yeah. be like, I love you guys. <laughs> and we have to run back <laughs> like to the right on, bay. Write it on the whiteboard, you fucking loser. <laughs> oh, God. Just <laughs> double down and bully him. <laughs> What's no, up, puss bag? <laughs> nice to meet you. <laughs> nah, that's, that's messed up. Because <laughs> I think we called Meg crazy, maybe. And then we ended up hanging out with her and she was like, cool in real life yeah her and kelsey are like still friends i think i don't know meg is super normal yeah so um, um so you know what everyone on the show is great super well <laughs> super well adjusted everyone's really smart and everyone's a perfect 10 <laughs> so this is not a true Incl- including hugo including um, hugo shout Gumby. out to west though man he uh He's doing great things. Yeah, go um, listen to his music. Yeah, uh, go peep his music. It's really it's... good. Um, maybe we can get him on the. Maybe we can get him on. We should have past people out on as guests, like just even via Zoom. I mean, I think he's just way too cool for this now. But well, Wes, if you're watching, <laughs> yeah, mate, if you'd like to mate. stop in and perhaps say something to the people, let us know. Have a chat. Yeah. If you'd like to have a chat, let us know, mate. I mean, I don't want to. I feel like we might be a little bit intimidating now. Yeah. You know? I mean, even on Zoom, I can't even imagine people not being scared. They're being scared even. Mm-hmm. Yeah. These bodies. So. Bro, when when Toby was sucking Kaz's toe <laughs> and Jake started great. filming it. <laughs> great segue. Yeah, when Jake started filming oh, yeah. it. Yeah, like from here too. Yeah, he was like, I'm filming it. I'm filming it. <laughs> Why would you... Telling people you're filming it <laughs> makes it weird. So he can go spank off in the That's shower. That's what I'm saying. After, like, dude. that to me was like he got caught. Or yeah. He was, you know, <laughs> he didn't want to get in trouble for that. Yeah. And then for him to immediately go, how'd it taste? <laughs> <laughs> that is like blatant. That's like, he's going to start OnlyFans after this show is over. Yeah. With all That's the clips I mean. he gets. <laughs> The world is your, your oyster, oyster after <laughs> Love Island. Uh, Jake. <laughs> Jake the toe suck. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's actually good. Let, why don't we go through all the characters and just, um, you so know, you rate, can... rate their bodies. No, I'm kidding. Let's Dang. go through all the characters. All right, Mark Zuckerberg. Just, <laughs> You're a four. And just, You're a three. Like, just so we can get to know the uh, their names. And right. I'm not a very big name. You're, you're a name guy. Yeah, I can. Somehow. I don't know. Wild. <laughs> yeah how many times we've done vips and i'm like oh what's up sean yeah like so he'll be like like we're at a fuck? show and someone or even in the crowd <laughs> like we're at a show and you recognize someone that was at a previous show <laughs> oh you're steve right they're the, they're even like dude uh <laughs> that's kind of sus <laughs> i'm like yeah i have you in my wallet <laughs> i have our picture of, of us in our wa- in my wallet these are your feet right yeah <laughs> what how'd you get that well, when, when you were at the last VIP, you were in sandals. <laughs> and I had our photographer, you know, skin match. So it's, it's, it's just details. fine. It's, details. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. These are your feet, nice right? Nice to see you. <laughs> These are your feet. It's confirmed. These are your feet? 
And these are your toes, right? These are them, right? <laughs> these are them, right? Oh, sultry little piggies. <laughs> Guys. Guys. Today's video is sponsored by SeatGeek. Love Island is back, and so are live events, and that means you're getting $20 off tickets at SeatGeek with promo code TMG. If you don't know what SeatGeek is, they're a ticketing app that makes buying tickets super simple. We've got the app on our phones. As you can see, it's on my telly. It's on my mobile. <laughs> I've got the app on my mobile. Whether it's concerts, baseball, basketball, football, you know, soccer. Footy, a little bit of footy. A little bit of footy. Festivals and more. SeatGeek puts tickets from all over the web in one place to make buying simple. Uh, what's For example, like? Elton John. <laughs> you can get tickets to Elton John right now. <laughs> SeatGeek rates every ticket from 0 to 10 to make sure you are getting a good deal. Green means good and red means bad. Could not be easier. Yeah. Uh, and don't worry if you was if you're like looking at an Elton John ticket and you're like, oh, it's kind of expensive. We've got the hookup for you. Yeah, we do. Use the code TMG for $20 off your tickets yeah. at SeatGeek. That's $20 off your first purchase with the promo code TMG. Make sure you click the link in the description to download the app. 20, 20 US quid. It's not a, it's not a, a currency, mate. It's 20 either quid US or dollars. Pounds. Sorry. All right. So this is Kaz. 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 Fashion blogger. Right. So she was the one that said she wants to get. Yeah. She wants to she get wants railed. She wants to get railed. Yeah. I think sex is an important part of any relationship, and I think everyone needs it. Yeah. Can't argue with that. She said, I want a guy to rail me. Can't argue with that. All right, Kaz. Um, Who do we got next? So scroll <clears throat> down. Brad. Yeah, Brad. Yeah, this guy is almost like Lebra. too good looking. <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, he, he looks like a video game character as well. Yes. Like, come on, fuck, fuck, look at the fucking dick veins he's got. <laughs> no, bro. This to me is like when you create a character in a, on like your Nintendo DS and then you scan your kid face onto an adult body. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that's like a 12 year old playing the Love Island game on DS. He's yep. like, <laughs> he took a picture of himself. He's like, that's me. <laughs> like, that's not you, man. <laughs> You can't even do 10 push-ups. <laughs> also, when he said laborer as his job, Alina and I thought he said, I'm a Libra. Oh, that's what I thought he said, too. Because I'm 26. I'm a laborer. What is a laborer? A laborer? A laborer. What is that? Like a construction? Maybe. Guy? Yeah, I don't, I don't know. But you know what was funny is when he mentioned that? Faye. Alina and I busted up laughing because Faye immediately, like, he's like I'm, she's like, what you do? Laborer, she goes, ah, oh. yeah, yeah, <laughs> it's just yeah. like immediate. Ugh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, another dumb hot guy. I'm a cancer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she, she's like, no, 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 I'm a laborer. She's like, I heard you. I heard you. I'm not a cancer. The same. We're not compatible, unfortunately. <laughs> um, yeah, that shit killed me. He's like, I live with me, Nana. <laughs> Every Wait, American so watching that is like, you live with a banana? <laughs> what the f what are you talking about, dude? <laughs> this show sucks, dude. Uh, this guy lives with a banana and he's a Libra. Why Who does Tim G like this show so much? It's so whack. <laughs> Yo, this Look dude at this guy's dick vein. Look at the veins <laughs> going into his shorts. Like, where do those even come from? Yo, what what? The, this, the, the sole intention of those veins are to fuel your boner. That's it. That's what happens when you take just enough uh, gas station pills. <laughs> you get the pump straight to your dick. Okay. Bro, what kills me is like when he was in the gym, he maxed out his lat stats. <laughs> he didn't care about anything else. Yeah. Lats 99. <laughs> All right, I'm moving on. Who's next? Um, okay, this is great. Shannon is Shannon. a former glam model. Former. So what are you now? She said she's a Twitch streamer. Oh, right. She's like, I play COD. I'm quite good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I do hot tub streams. What was hilarious is when she brought up that she plays COD and she's really good at games. The dude, uh, Aaron, was like, cool. <laughs> it was the first time I've seen a dude hear a woman say, I play games, and he didn't perk up. <laughs> she he, like, bullied reaction. her for being a nerd almost. Like, he's like, cool. She might as well said she was a laborer. Yeah. Yeah. He's like, ah. <laughs> ugh, ugh. He's like, Sick. you're a gamer. Right, and just walks away. <laughs> <laughs> the first guy ever not to think that's cool. Yeah, just I, it was like crazy. He played games like a child. Mm. Yeah, I've got a nephew. He plays games. <laughs> so like that. She's like, yes, yeah, it's a slap. 
It was proper fun. I'm like, quite good. You know what's funny is I didn't hear what she said when she was, and I had to like ask Kelsey, what did she say she was? And Kelsey was like, ah, she plays Call of Duty. Like just knowing <laughs> that I would be like, what? That's sick. <laughs> I'm surprised he didn't freak around. Oh, she's a car, but she's my favorite, dude. She's my favorite. She's yeah. so cool. So cool. I couldn't believe that. Just didn't, his eyes didn't move at that. Wow. And I know every nerd watching this was like, you, you fucking, you, these games, dude. Yeah, dude. You don't know what you have, It's the fucking one. <laughs> she's what a fucking She's a queen. <laughs> All right, go on. Next. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Aaron. My, my five million dollar. Um, oh yeah, yeah. Uh, my five million Manchester dollar Manchester apartment. My, this is my five million dollar Manchester flat, <laughs> and the five million dollar part is my Twitch stream. <laughs> Join Phase, Phase Shannon. Yeah, uh, this is Aaron. He's twenty four, and he thinks gamers <laughs> are stupid. <laughs> I'm Aaron. I'm twenty four, and I think gaming is for idiots. Shannon may have met oh. Oh. Shannon may have met her match in Aaron who is always traveling abroad for work. Sick. My man, events host. Oh yeah, she he like he does like night nightlife shit. Yeah. He's like uh, you know, one of the socialites. Yeah, he's like <laughs> I do VIP events. Oh he, my god. I read that quote before I read the sentence before. Go up. What do you say? Go up a little bit. That last sentence. Aaron, I bang them out on a regular basis. Oh. And then I read that what it said before. Aaron said his worst habit is farting. Yo, I like that. See? Why didn't they put that in the interview? <laughs> yeah. Then we would have had some, like, real shit to go into. It's yeah. like if Kaz is like, I love getting railed. Yeah. Jake's like, I love suckling toes. <laughs> and you go to this dude, and he's like, I'm always farting. <laughs> I, Every, bang, I bang them out on the regular. Every dude would been like, my boy. Yeah. That's my boy right there. I bang them out when I'm banging out. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, wonderful. No, what was the word? Were they? <laughs> mm, yes. Mm, quite. 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 Mm, yes. Quite. Mm, quite. Commensurate. Mm, commensurate. <laughs> <laughs> right, so right, Aaron, Aaron doesn't like gamers. What else? We, who else is? Who there? else we got here? Keep moving. I know. We got Shannon. She's a Sharon. Sharon. Sorry. That's that's her Sharon. Name. Civil Shannon. servant. Sharon's a smart one. Yep. Uh, go wait. Go up again. So prior to this, she was a beauty queen and landed the title of Miss International UK. Oh, right. Sharon's type is tall, dark, and willing to put me in line if I'm too sassy or straightforward. Mm. Okay. Whatever, whatever that means. Whatever that means. Okay. Keep going. So she, she's the smart one. Yeah. And then we got Hugo, a.k.a. Gumby. All right. Say so you're sorry to Gumby. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. To Hugo. <laughs> no, because he, he's a nice guy. No, he is. I think it's just two nights. It's just a different show. He should be on the batch, the UK version of The Bachelor. Yeah. yeah if he yeah. was like that guy. Yeah. Oh, dude, kill it. Yeah. Oh my God, he's PE teacher. Yeah. Wants to help people. Yeah. He All that. The youth. Yeah. Unless, bro, what if this next episode he just like comes out? And he is savage. Like he's like. Oh, students like he's is never gonna look at me the same. Yeah, like he's an absolute coxman. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Absolute, uh, uh, damn, I got nothing. <laughs> Absolute sausage slinger. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> there you go. Um, he admitted he's never asked a girl to call him Mr. Hammond. <laughs> I don't think I could do it without laughing. I just told him to call me daddy. Yeah. <laughs> That's the second half of the quote. All right. Let's move on. Um, Chloe. So this is the girl that. Oh, I got, I got, I, I got their names wrong. I said. I said Sharon was Chloe earlier, but she, but she is Sharon. She Wait, is Sharon? isn't Chloe the one that came in at the end? Or no? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that, that is Chloe. I'm just saying. I so we haven't met her yet. No. Okay. I fucked Sharon's name up though. Yeah. That's all. It's okay. I mean, bro, she's That's like, a lot. she. I think she looks. She, she looks like she was six one in those shoes. The girl that came in at the end, Sharon. Yeah. No, the, the oh, smart Sharon. One. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. She no, could, she did. She was. She was tall. She could whoop my ass. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I know for sure. Yeah. So actually, being um, in civil service yeah, is awesome. It's man. really cool. It's, I mean, that's really not. That's a really great thing to do. Like, <laughs> we think you're gonna go very far on the show. Please don't come to this. And you're so and smart. Your you're so smart. <laughs> Nonsense, mate. Have you seen my chest? Oh, yeah. It's nothing she uh, could do, lad, mate. Lad. So yeah, I think you know. Obviously, obviously, it's hard to like really you know get into it because there's not a lot that's happened. But like next week, I feel like it's gonna be proper trauma yeah do you know no. oh, there's jake the there's water jake. engineer yeah what the fuck is a water engineer uh ian sterling kept 
cooking him and calling him a plumber. Oh, by the by the way, is that what it is? I think so. Maybe. Okay. By the way, his commentary was fucking Ace. on point. Hilarious. So funny. I, I laughed Ian. out loud multiple times. Yeah. At this episode. Shout out Ian, man. I can't remember the funniest bits, but I want to say I also had one more thing written down. I'm I'm, I'm now I'm just getting all the pen. <laughs> oh yeah, when she when sorry when Liberty and him were flirting, like like near the end of the episode, and she was like, I like ya. You're so like goofy, and he's like goofy. goofy. No. I'm not goofy. Yeah. No, not me. I'm not goofy. <laughs> I was like, dude, calm the fuck. What are you? Somebody called him that in, in childhood. He yeah. did not like that yeah. shit. Yeah. He's like goofy. No, it's not it. <laughs> he had a, it's not he had a, it. He had a traumatizing uh, time at Disney Disneyland or <laughs> the London Disney World or whatever. <laughs> no, I think Is it goofy. It must have been like some girl of his dream situation. She called him goofy. Yeah. Just yeah, never again. That's why he's yeah. so yoked. Yeah. He, like, worked his hair not, like that. I'm not goofy. Yeah, he put on that whole... Like, I'm not. Put on that old shell. And yeah. one girl sees right through it. She's like, no, you're goofy. <laughs> what? 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 I'm fucking not, mate. What? What'd you say? I'm cool. <laughs> I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm cool. So this is the guy I was talking about. So, like, not... Like, you know, I, I wouldn't say he's, like, crazy, you know attractive by any means i mean he's definitely a good looking guy but i think that his shit it, he's he's gonna be the funny one no he's gonna have sure. the chat he's gonna have the banter yeah that's girls what, are gonna fall in love with him for that's that. why i think in castle more he's gonna be like oh this a, a, a hound yeah <laughs> not even i think he's gonna be like a show dog like or like not even like a hunting dog like mm. just off his leash yeah just picking up like, new scents you know, sling a joke here sling a joke yeah. there and yeah. just you know yeah. see what see what pops off where yeah that dude, that moment when Liberty uh, was like, "I get my looks from me mom. She looks really good for her age." And then Jake's like, "I wish I could meet your mom <laughs> and suck her toes." I'm like, "This dude has like, like when you clip out all these small comments." Yeah. I'm like, "This dude is horny <laughs> as fuck." Oh yeah, yeah, he is. It's like probably him and Kaz would be a good pair. Yeah. Yep. Because he's horny. Yeah. Like you know, like. Hidden in plain sight, horny. Yeah. And she's like, yeah, I love, I love to be pinned. Yeah. That dude. I feel like they're going to have a few drinks, and one night he'll just lean he's over. A, he's a hound. He's a horn dog. I bet I could suck your toes better than Toby. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> I will lick your toes. <laughs> lick your toes. <laughs> With the tip of my lick it. <laughs> and then we got Faye. Yeah, Crazy Faye. eyes. Yeah, lettings manager. What is a lettings manager? Faye said she wants somebody who who can literally rip her a new asshole. I mean, hmm. Then she goes, "Well, not like that. Li oh, like not li literally, not literally." <laughs> oh, yeah. Her whole thing was, uh, you know, I'm I'm fiery. I'm this and that. So she, she I mean, I I don't like her already. Like, it just her, her personality. She's like clearly. I don't, I feel like she's never been told no so she was like even at the beginning was really uh mm. like offended when the guy didn't when when toby oh and aaron aaron, aaron picked, was aaron yeah it was aaron he so picked, she stepped uh, forward for aaron yeah. and aaron picked another girl and she was like well he didn't even remember my name so i dodged a bullet <laughs> yeah yeah. and yeah. then and then when kale or the fucking other the guy brad dude yeah put, the brad guy also forgot her name she didn't say shit no he was like oh to the blue bikini yeah and she was like oh, okay come over here <laughs> So, I don't know. Incel's going to clip out that moment. It's a double standard. <laughs> no, I mean, I just, it could have been the guy. Like, I'm, it doesn't matter. I'm just saying she, yeah, I can I tell. That. Like, she, she was a little bit, like, in her, she's a little bit abrasive throughout the whole show. Mm -hmm. Like, she never really was charming to me. No, I mean, like, when, when uh, the Brad dude was talking, I don't know if it was just editing, but it didn't seem like she was trying to talk to him. Yeah. She was just letting him go and yeah. then complaining after the fact, like, yeah. And staring just yeah, she's doing the Chuck E. Cheese eyes. But <laughs> never, <laughs> never never <laughs> even saying anything or asking a question. That's probably why he's talking in circles. <clears throat> like, it's like quite nice. We could like all get to know each other. Yeah, and she's just like Just <laughs> analyzing his face. <laughs> he's like, Oh, so emotion yeah. detected. So you could like like I said, we could get to know each other. The show will start in three <laughs> minutes. <laughs> you don't want to miss the pizza bash. <laughs> Bro, Nate, 
you watched Nate Bargatze's new special? Not what yet. he did outside? No. Oh, he's got such a great bit about Chuck E. Cheese, basically about how they've been trying to go out of business, but they can't. <laughs> They're like trying to be a blockbuster, but yeah. they just, they can't. Like for some reason, just they keep surviving. <laughs> So none of this shit works anymore. Yeah. And the, the pizza's recycled. And it's just... <laughs> uh, it's so funny. He's like, just parents drinking at like yeah. nine in the morning. And I'm not seeing any Ubers taking those kids home. <laughs> just I'm, I'm butchering it. Go watch his special. It's fucking phenomenal. He's uh, like my favorite comedian ever. What is this? This is the video that I sent out. But this is like... It doesn't matter. Trailer. Yeah, we we kind of nailed this. I think we've talked all we can talk about the first episode, to be honest. No, yeah, I mean, I think there's really nothing left but to do what we need to do. Let's make our character in the Love Let's Island game. Let's bring Kodo into the new season. Shall we? Of the Love Island game. So we'd be at season four, everybody. Wow. Season oh, four coming oh. soon. Why wouldn't they start at the same time as the as the show? Fail, bro. Oh, because it's the American one, probably? Maybe. Do we need to wait? Nah, fuck that. Let's play season three. We never did season three. No, we didn't. Hit it. Um, by the way, you might as well just go ahead and load up on those gems. Run that card. Run it, dude. <laughs> use the use the business card. All right, Run yeah. that shit. Hit, let's go to season three, baby. Oh, it crashed. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Thank you, Fuse Box. <laughs> oh, you remember Noah? Oh, uh, yeah. Dork. <laughs> <laughs> Librarian, <laughs> what a nerd! You oh man, I wish season four was. So you play games? Yeah. All right, stick the landing. We don't even care. Here we let's go make again. Our girl. The villa has a new. Cri it's the first. Whatever. Let's hit that play button. Yeah, hit the play button. Let's go. We gotta make a. We gotta make us. We gotta yep. make our character. Here we go again. Indeed. <laughs> Here we go. You know what's crazy? Is that, well, you know what? Actually, yeah. You just save it? What? What are you about to say? Ah, oh, just some inside baseball stuff. Oh. Not important. Yeah, We're here no. at the villa. <laughs> yeah. We have to, like, In Mallorca. We got to, now we got to, I hope there's a blast off station from here. Yeah, a, that's the, a beam up no, station. there is. There, there is? is? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So it's like, we got to commute every week to back to. No, no, no. That's okay. how, that's why, you know, getting here was so easy because we were able to fly over, drop down. And this is that little town that's like about like an hour away from here. Okay. So we can go Take in and train. out of there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. We're actually, it was crazy. We're at the villa and all the people are still inside. Like they just keep them inside until we're done with the show. And then and we yeah, wrap we just and then they yeah. keep filming. So it's crazy because, you know, in one way you could say that, you know, we're not really afraid of the people that we're talking about because they're literally right there. Mm -hmm. 20 steps exactly. from us. We're talking that shit. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. Gumby. You heard me? <laughs> with the door locked. All right. Let's, let's get this forward. How are you supposed to have time for? We we know what this is, man. Let's make our lady. Yeah, just just crush it. Fast forward right until the fucking character. You've been invited to a place where everyone gets to know each other and fuck. <laughs> a place called Love, Love Island. Island. Welcome back to Love Island. <laughs> Choose your appearance. Okay, here we go. Let's here we go. It, Let's go. Your wardrobe. Close. Uh, X. All right. Go to the left. Oh, no, no, the right, sorry. One more. This is us. That's us. This is that bronze yes. Codell look. Yes, it is. With the red hair. I can't believe we're bringing her back. We just now go to eyes. Codell got her beautiful green eyes. Uh, oh, yeah. Check, check. Ba -da -ba. Green. Green. Stun. Like emeralds. Um, the nose and lips. Nose. Are. Make it a sick nose. Yeah, I don't know how you. I mean, it's all kind of the same. Go to the, the one on the right. Yeah, yeah, no, that one. Yep. Yeah, Cuddle's nose is a little bit thinner. Yep. Yeah, that's the right one. I think lips are fine. Luscious lips. Nah, keep. Yeah. Put that red hair right back. Yeah. Yep. 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 Oh no, let's go orange. Let's go. Let's be a ginge. That's what. That's what she. Yeah, she she's was. Got yeah. Red, she's right. got red. You're right. Yep. Wait. No, no, no. <clears throat> go to go to red again. Go to red. Let's get this right. That's the. No, color. that's brown. Is that brown? Yeah, we want. Yeah, we need the we, fire. Yes, yeah. yes, yes, yes. We need to make a statement here, folks. Yeah, orange. Yeah. I was just listening to that. Those are good lashes. That Bo Burnham song. Nope. You ever heard that one? Go back. 
yeah, yeah, that's solid. Yeah. Where he's talking that. about sad things in the world. No. Nah. And then he just says, I saw a boy who was a ginger. Oh, yeah. And that's <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I just saw a boy with it. red hair. <laughs> What's so fucked up? <laughs> <laughs> what do you want to be called? Oh, I think we know the answer to this. This name, C O D E L. Woo! Um. So, just like the first episode, you know, we gotta, we just gotta um, get in there. Wow. And get busy. Um, so, this is the do? look. This is the look. This is the look. The look. No, we've played before, yeah, bro. Yeah, trust me. We've played before. What should I wear? Oh, this is the best part. Picking her clothes. Yeah, let's go. Um, <laughs> ooh, that orange one. The one to the left, kind of with the hair. I'm fucking with the floral. Okay, the one to the left? Yeah. That shit is like... That kind of hits. <laughs> you know, It's a little LA, though. Yeah, but it like... Accents the skin tone. Okay. You know? Yep. Yeah. So, yeah. Okay. I like the. Yeah, you know, it like draws it. attention to the to the runs. Yeah. Nature of the skin. Yeah. Burn those gems. Hot fifteen. Do it. Brrr. Unlock that skin. I look amazing. I look amazing. Well, I'd say so. I look amazing. Yeah, by the way, all the all the you know, the ad money that we get from this, like from doing advertisements, it's all going into gems. Yeah, it's all going to gems. <laughs> Next time, this episode is going to have 9 billion gems. <laughs> Whatever couple hundred dollars we make, we're going to put it all on gems. All right, so we're going to play this not what? on. We'll play it in the background? Yeah, like we'll 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 still do some gameplay on yep. but obviously like every episode is like an hour long. So um, we, we'll pretty much have to like recap parts of the game and yeah. then we'll play some parts. Yeah. That's, that's why we never finished it the first time because if you actually sit there and play it, it takes, I don't know, 16, 17 hours. And it got like boring. Yeah. It was the same shit over and over yeah. again. And we're like, dude, this is not going to, this series is just not going to yeah. um, continue being. Nah. Because it's like, it's like when you first meet the characters and yeah it's like the real love island kind of gets boring like when they're <laughs> then they're actually coupled up and they're mm -hmm. everyone's in love then you're, you're like ah like, oh, what happens now kinda, yeah exactly yeah. it's like near the end of the show it kind of gets like that so uh, um, but we're gonna keep playing it and we'll clip it out and and um yeah it'll be a segment on yeah. the show yeah so um <clears throat> but i mean i think i think yeah i think we've got it for this episode so next week we'll obviously recap what's going on in the villa and we will play the game um, I know today your pe people are like, I thought you were going to fucking play. We will play. Yeah, we'll play. Um, just not this episode. <laughs> yeah. Does that mean? No. Is that, is that messed up? No, I mean, this. Show, we wanted to watch the show too and, and comment, commentate. Uh, not, a wor not a word, but yeah. we wanted to commentate. Conversate. On, conversate about the, uh, the show because we watch it and it's on every single day. So there's plenty of shit that goes down. Yeah. We, the first episode was yesterday. Second one's today, and yep. then it, now it's on every day until next week. So we're going to have a ton of shit to talk about. Watch along with us if you want to have fun listening to the show. And we hope you like the first episode. We appreciate everyone All of you. for joining us. Let us know if there's anything you'd like us to, to cover off on. Yeah, that too. We'd love to take we'd love, your, we'd love to your know. opinions. <clears throat> take you for a ride. Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. going to be a really hot summer. That's right, in it? All right. We got to go... Uh, unload our trend and beam up and beam up to the ship yeah it's isn't that crazy that machine up there that it can just drain the trend and then put it back yeah it is pretty pretty wild it's so crazy thanks for watching guys see ya goodbye goodbye